All right, so this next one is coming at us from... Okay, so this next one actually is very important. Because this next one is a Disney property. And Disney has been doing absolutely terrible. And um, I don't want to get... I don't want to take too long on this, okay? But I do just want to say almost everything that has happened in the last year for Disney... Like, oh, well, just, just think about just this year, 2023. So far, everything that's happened in 2023 has either been a failure or barely broke even. Basically, almost every, basically everything's been a failure this year. Every big movie has been a failure for Disney this, this year. The next movies that Disney has is the one that we're about to talk about and the Marvels. No matter what you think about it, Brie Larson is very controversial. And a lot of people just don't like her and some of the things that she said and may not support her movie, The Marvels, financially. So that leaves one, and it's the one that we're going to talk about right now. So let's check it out. We are, wa well, one second, I have an, actually have a five-second little little ad playing. Um, and one second, here we go. Okay, so let's check it out. We are watching the trailer for Elemental. Official trailer. Leah Lewis and Mamadou Athi. I, I hope I said that properly. If I if I messed that up, please please forgive me. Okay. Uh, this coming to us from IGN. We're going to like it. Uh, take another look at Disney and Pixar's Elemental in this new teaser. I, I haven't seen anything about and about this um, before, so that's interesting. When it says check it out, check it out in a new teaser. But uh, the upcoming movie features the voices of Leah Lewis and Mamadou. Mamadou Athi as Ember and Wade. Respectively, Elemental is set in Elemental City with fire, water, earth, and air residents live together. The story introduces Ember, a tough, quick-witted, and fiery young woman whose friendship with a fun, sappy, go-with-the-flow guy named Wallace challenges her beliefs about the world they live in. Uh, okay, and it opens in theaters on June 16th. So that's what I'm saying. Not a whole lot of hype because I haven't heard of this. It's coming out on June 16th and... This is the first time that I have seen a trailer, and I, and I, to my understanding, yeah, so these are two smaller time actors. I haven't really seen them, seen them, but, uh, in a lot of stuff. But, um, again, the fact that this trailer is coming out a little late, and the hype for this movie is almost non-existent, makes me a little bit worried for Disney's success here. <laughs> um, but anyway, we've got a 30 second trailer. Are you ready, Staff Sergeant Matt? I am ready. Let's do it. In Element City, there's air, earth, water, water and fire. Ah. But we don't mix. Hot, holy dewdrop! Something is happening in Element City. This is our home. We have to uh, fix. I'm trying to remember. Maybe we have seen this. I can't. I, maybe I think we might have actually done a trailer reaction to this before, but I don't remember it. Maybe I don't know. I'm sure that somebody in the comments is going to be like, you did a reaction to this one before. Now, anyway. unlikely friends will become unexpected heroes. Hop on! Yeah. Watch out! Yeah, looks like I'm going home early today. Disney Pixar. All right. So what did you think? Let's hear what you have to say first. It's, it's a tease. It's really fast yeah you know it also reminds me of what was that movie called osmosis Dead? jones <laughs> what the was it with, uh, the joy the happy oh yeah 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 not the emoji movie it was what like was it was like the emotion inside out there you go inside out yeah I will tell you. Let me show. Let me, let me watch the watch this now. Inside Out, right? Uh huh. Inside Out box office. Inside Out made eight hundred and fifty-eight million dollars. Would you look at that? Now, here's the thing, though, and I agree with you because it does look. Was that a Disney one? Was it Inside Out? Yeah, it was. It was in. It, it's a similar animation style. Um, That's one. Yeah, similar animation and style. And they're hoping to recover with the same 
same pattern. Right, right. And I'll tell you, they need it. They need something because they really have not made any money this year. That They've reported a big loss and everything. So I'll tell you what my problem is, though, is when did Inside Out come out? Let's Actually, I just saw it, but let's, let's look it up. Inside Out. Um, release. 2015. 2015. Okay, so that that was five, five, ten. Wait, no, not ten. Five, eight years ago. That was eight years ago that Inside Out came out. A big part of you know basically when it comes to like movies at the theater making money is not the quality of the movie, but it's people's faith in the movie. Because I, whether the movie is good or bad. I am not going to go see it in the theater unless I think it's going to be good and worth my money to see in theaters. So even if it gets positive reviews, if it's coming from a, you know, like let's say Disney makes a bunch, like because this is basically what's happened, is Disney makes a bunch of bad movies, and then somebody comes out and says, well, this last one that they made wasn't bad, maybe you should go see it. I'm going to think to myself... For the last three years, they haven't made anything good, so I'm not going to go see it. I'll see it when it comes out on DVD. So yeah, then the exactly. movie doesn't, yeah. So then the then the movie doesn't do well at the box office. That's the situation that happened to Ant Man, in my opinion, and it and this it may just be the situation that's going to happen with this movie. Is that even if this movie is good, I think that faith in Disney at the box office has dwindled so much that even if it's good, it may not matter because people's faith in them has dwindled. Yeah. Does that make well, sense? I think they're just copying a pattern that worked before. Yeah. And that's going to backfire. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I, I mean, other than that, though, I mean, it, it, it could be an interesting interesting idea, depending on how they do it. Like I said, I just I just don't have faith that they're going to make something that's really great. Like, like, they've really lost not just a step, they've lost quite a few steps. Um, and yeah. so... Yeah, so it makes it makes me weary of giving them my money to watch their movies. So yeah, but like you said, most people will wait for it to come out on DVD or on Netflix. Yeah, or streaming. Yeah, and where they can see it for free. Yeah. So anyway, let's check out what people. What let's see what people have to say about it. Some of you may have noticed a headline error. It has been corrected. We are very sorry. <laughs> oh, okay, so apparently they put a thing wrong. When IGN said, R I truly cried, <laughs> this is one of the titles of all time. Uh, one second. Man, could I, okay, so they made a thing, they fixed it. Oh, my lord. <laughs> I'm trying to find a comment about the actual movie. In a few decades, students will probably have to analyze the meaning and intentions behind this inspiring title. My lord. Okay, not really getting much excitement for this, but I'm down for anything that helps pro uh, propel this guy's career further. Dude is a fantastic newer face. Shame only his voice is getting the attention here. So there you go. Like, of all the comments making fun of the title, you know. Um, one guy says that he's not excited for the movie, but he likes the actor. Um... Let me see. This is truly the most revolutionary new... Oh, come on. Give me a thing. Okay. So apparently IGN messed up on the title and now all of the comments are about that rather than the movie themselves. I'm not finding any real substantive comments for us to look at, so I'm gonna. we're just going to move on. Um, and yeah. So that's it. <laughs> um, I want to... What was the R... One second. IGN R title. Just a second. I can't. I wanted to see Elemental. I just wanted to see if I could find it real quick. Elemental. There you go. Uh, I don't see it. I don't see it. I don't see it. Okay, never mind. I'll have to see if I can find it. If I can find it, I'll post it on Facebook, guys. Um, right there. Wait, where are you seeing it? It's supposed to be an R in the title. No, no, I don't know. I don't know. It just says that we are very sorry. So that's why I was saying, like, where is the R? Where was the R supposed to be? Yeah, I don't know. But anyway, if I can find it, I'll post it on the Facebook. So go check out Mike's After Action Reviews Facebook and follow us over there. Um, <clears throat> 
But uh, let's move forward on to the next one because uh, we did take a little bit. Like I said, we have been taking a little bit of time. We're going to move through these just a little bit quicker. Um, here we go. Moving on. Oh, and go check this one out on when did they say June 16th? So go check this out on June 16th. Don't forget to check me out on Twitch and join the Discord where you can voice chat with me while a live stream and you won't be recorded or anything on YouTube and Twitch, so that's pretty cool. You can also find me on Facebook and Instagram. If you like to read, you can see my after action reports on my blog. And if you are interested, you can get some merch from my spring store. The links for everything are in the description below.